what is up guys Clown Prince Terra again so um, what I'm gonna be doing on this video is uh, kind of showing how to how I'm gonna be making my Finn Balor headdress um, this is something I've been actually doing working on for quite a while I'm not gonna lie uh, this right here um, I'm gonna try to put pictures at the end of the video so you guys can see like what exactly it looked like but this right here what it used to be is uh, one of those beanies you can see it's a uh, Oakland Raider don't worry guys I'm not a Raiders fan I don't watch football so yeah so don't freaking kill me on that one it's just uh, when I got this it was uh, obviously the beanie was black it had black strands and it had white and silver black white and silver strands like little dreads so you could, this is like a winter time thing so probably coming up soon you can probably find these again they had like different colors like obviously like the Seahawks and other ones but like I said this was just like perfect because it has black beanie and it had black um, kind of these little dread things already so uh, I just stuck with that I ended up painting uh, a lot of the gray and the white ones uh, pretty much all the gray and the white ones um, into red and black again um, I wish I had videos I took pictures before I'll see if I can find them but pretty much what I used I went to Michaels and I grabbed like fabric paint as you can kind of see you can still kind of see the white and the gray in it um, I didn't get it too good that was the best I could do I put so many layers on this thing it wasn't even funny like I seriously spent a lot of money on just this, the spray itself to get the gray and white ones black and red again um, not again but black and red in general uh, so you I mean you can kind of tell like right here and like certain lights see that's perfect and there you can see where it used to be gray you know like here it's flat you can't but like there's certain angles where you could see it like pretty good so it's still not the best thing but that's as, to be honest guys that's as far as I can get it I've like I said I spent so many time money time and money getting trying to get these red so this is what I was gonna go because I'm be going to raw here you know uh, on beginning of December uh, and I'm gonna hopefully go dress this Finn Balor so I painted the sign out black with permanent marker I try to find a patch but I, I don't know I'll probably still try to look for a patch and see if I can cover that up somehow I'd rather have a, a blank patch instead of a Raider sign to be honest but yeah, so I have that, and then what this is, is I already cut it up, but this was the actual headdress that came with the Finn Balor um, costume. They were selling at the WWE shop this year. I think it sold out pretty quick, because I, I saw it, I bought it, and it, no joke, like sold out really quick. So uh, with this headdress, like I said, I'll put up pictures if I can find it online of how it looked like. It came with already with these, like, strands. Um, you see, I have, like, this weird little clear tubey thing. Um, it has some red and black strands and it has like a you know like a thick braid or whatever you want to call it or dread whatever you want to call it and then they were just hooked on you know how Finn has like those leather uh, things in the front that hold it from coming onto his face so what I pretty much did was cut that off the beanie so this is all together by one piece it's already sewn on like that and all I'm gonna do is gonna I'm gonna pick the five in the front and then just gonna sew it on that way so it's gonna be kind of what I made and then the one that came with the costume because the one with the game with the costume it wasn't that bad it wasn't the best and it wasn't that bad and like this one I honestly think is a lot better like yeah some of the co color could be you know better obviously but I like this one a lot better it's more custom made and like I said like so all I'm gonna do is take this put it in front of one one of these patches sew it on there and then it should be pretty good so then uh, I'll show you guys what the funnel product looks like of that and then I have my um the things that Finn has, obviously the arm sleeves, I bought the regular ones and then I bought the ones that came with the costume. But it has like these little, uh, you know, hold on real quick, let me find them for you guys. Okay, guys, so like here's here's one here's the one that came with the costume. This one that came with the costume. It's darker and it's a little bit more bigger. And then it comes with these little you know, the little things he has at the end. So what I'm gonna do is get um some fabric I, I bought from I think it was Joanne's or whatever it's called. Uh, I'm just gonna to be honest, I'm gonna sew those onto like a hair tie and then just gonna put it around my wrist so that it can be longer. I don't like how small these ones are to be honest. They look they could just kind of look kind of pathetic to be honest the small ones and then this is the one you could buy off the site which is even more pathetic is these little three strands like it's really weird and like these ones I don't have the biggest I don't have the biggest arms in the world 
you know, but like, um, it, it it's when you put these on, at least for me, when I put these on, it stretches it out and it almost looks gray. You guys can see, look, here's black. And then just by stretching it out, it just whitens up the color. So I'll probably end up wearing these. And instead of sewing on more strands to here, just because I know it, like if I'm having something in my hand, I know it'll bother me. I'm just gonna put them on a hair tie and that way I could just slip them off when I need to. So yeah, so that, I'll show you guys my little wrist things when I make them. But for now, it's just the, for now, it's just the hairdress or the headdress. So yeah, so I'm gonna go ahead and sew those on and then uh, I'll let you guys know what it looks like. I'll probably take a video right now before and show you guys how it looks like in the mirror with just without sewing these on. I'll just show you how this looks like on me. So yeah. What is up guys? So I finished the uh headdress for the most part. You guys can see it. Sorry, there you go. Uh better look of it. Like I said, I just sewed on these four patches right here. Might have to sew this one back a little bit. You guys can tell it's kinda like it droops down in front. I kind of want this to be shown because Finn usually has his shown, you know, and then it droops. So I might just sew, sorry, I might just sew this part back just so I can droop a little bit. Um, I was able to find a black patch for the little Raider sign. I mean, it sticks out, but it's, I mean, it's sort of the Raider sign, so it's just kind of the same. I'd just rather be blank than have a Raider sign. Um, I was able to, this right here is actually yarn. I just found a kind of thick yarn and I just poked it through and just created my own stitching um, it is kind of thick I would probably maybe like go to a thicker like actual like thread like string um, and it started to like unwind you know like yarns a bunch of strings together so it kind of started to unwind a bit but I mean it came up pretty good I'd say you see it all the way around down there I kind of try to look at one of the, the um, at least that I have and I kind of based stuff for that and then other pictures it just kind of looks like it goes around his face so same with this area here it just kind of droops down I kind of want it to stick back like this so I'll probably just sew straight down here and then have it clear up my face a little bit um this thing that sucks that it is going to be it is a beanie so it's going to be hot so I'm still planning on dressing this Finn when I go to raw so we'll see um how the paint <laughs> sticks with that um yeah so we'll see i mean we'll cross our bridge when it comes so um with the arm uh with the little i guess you call them gauntlets or whatever uh like i said same thing i just freaking use that glue it seems to be holding sorry guys it seems to be holding so let me just kind of just dangles down you guys can see uh this side, I, don't, I don't have arm sleeve uh this arm sleeve is the one i got with the costume that came with uh the headdress i took apart but this is the, the this one um like I said the other one turns kind of gray because it's you know it, it it's it's a lot tighter, but um, it, it just turns gray when I have it on. This one actually stays black. It's a little loose down here at the bottom, but um, it's still pretty pretty good. And there's you can see little gauntlets with it. Yeah, there you go. You can see little gauntlets with it on this side. So yeah, um, it's already getting kind of hot. <laughs> uh, but yeah, it was a. Uh, What's up guys, Clark Finstera uh, here with my brother and he's going to help me uh, get ready for a raw. I'm going to try the Finn Maller, uh paint so yeah I'll probably fast forward this or like I do like a time lapse or fast forward it but for now I'm just going to record so let's get into it. Where's the Fucking. Are you recording it? Yeah. Y'all gonna be on YouTube. Y'all be on the tube. How you do? <laughs> oh my god. Like, you gotta, gotta put that part in. You gotta put that part in. No, don't do it. My you queer, gotta put queer brother. How you do? Queer. <laughs> Alright, I'll do the face part later. So then. Let's only close the door, guy. We Did you outline that? that?
So guys, the Clumpers Dera, uh, pretty much done with uh, the help of my brothers. So yeah, so this is the final thing. See the light. Uh, didn't go too crazy on the black. The red just kind of faded. Um, gonna be wearing my commemorative belt the whole time pretty much. So that way, I, that's why I didn't do any painting on the bottom part. And then uh, wore some black small shorts and then kick pads and some knee pads. So, and then I'll put on my headdress so you guys can see kind of the final product. So there it is. Final product, so should be a lot of fun. Be recording on the way there. And then uh, make sure you be posting while we're there in the place. So yeah, a lot of fun doing this. So hopefully, Die. see how it is. No, it's not dead. It's just no. the screen went black. You ruined his outro, man. Oh but, my God. Uh, yeah, so should be a lot of fun. <laughs> and uh, yeah, but keep on posting videos of this. So thank you. What's up guys so getting ready to go right now start loading up i take a couple videos on the way there but uh yeah should get there pretty early and just hang out and try to sell my belt so Kevin Owen. should be a lot of fun Joel. can't wait to see finn fuck roman fuck roman fuck roman come on the guy's a nice guy no he's not don't no fuck roman